Mayang botak. Mayang botak. Mobile Legends. I'm playing ML. Such a Filipina. <laughs> Mayang botak. Oh my goodness. I'm sorry. Okay. <laughs> Mai botak. Mai botak. Mai botak. Mai botak. Botak botak. Everybody. How's it going? All is good. Yeah. We're uh Crater Hunters picking us up today because Blue Thunder is being repaired. Pick them up again tomorrow. Now we're going to go to Spot. Yeah, let's go to Malatapai, chillax day, last day with Anna, and we'll drop her off in Dumaguete tomorrow. So, what are you guys gonna do while we're scuba diving? Photoshoot. <laughs> Chilling like a villain. Is it safe to say? that I burned you guys out in adventures for the last couple of days and you just want to chill now? <laughs> just feels like a month here. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to my life and hanging out with me. This is what you get. <laughs> How about I me? Asked, yeah. I asked her for an adventure. She, she, you both gave it to me. <laughs> now they're too exhausted after we'll a couple of days. will be back in a normal days. life too, Nikki. Yeah. He will be in a... No yeah. So me, Justin, we're, we're gonna dive and they're gonna relax. Yeah, that's what you get when hanging out with me. <laughs> Sleep and adventure. How's everyone in the Critter Mobile? Everybody's comfy down there? Yeah, we're good here. Look at Chick Chick. He's the Critter. He loves it. You like the Critter Mobile, Chick. It's okay. Stay there. Last time we put the seat up, but it's just me and Phil. And Jake had the whole back to run around. Yeah, yeah. What? No seat. Alright, we're on our way to Malatapai. By the way, we're not sure it's open. There's like new lockdown thing. I don't want to go into details or bother with it. I'm not going to read the news. By the way, the reason I say that is that we can be so attached to news and media and they can like kind of dictate our lives and decisions. So the more you ignore the news and follow your own life, you're going to have a better experience. If that's I guess I'm trying to say that, but uh... Stop it, it's not good. No, it's actually really good. My, my parents in the US watch more news about Philippines than I do, and they're always convinced that we're about to die from a volcano, the or super earthquake. typhoon, or like COVID or exactly something. Exactly my point. I'm like, Mom, you're in Montana, shut up. <laughs> well, the market is definitely open. Yeah, it's Wednesday, Wednesday market. Yeah, but there's like a lockdown now. No, nothing lockdown. No lockdown no. here, huh? No, do we get it? They close down today. Oh, it's just do we get it? I don't know, but for sure do we get it? We don't want to know. We just we live our life, and if we're not allowed to go somewhere, we'll just go back. Alex, are you live streaming? No, not today. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What did you find yesterday? Yeah. Anything good? Put your pin, pin house reef? Yeah. Uh, I found the. Uh, Bob tail. Bob tail squid? Yeah, That's like nice. three to four, but he using only the GoPro. Ah. So, uh, no chance. No, no chance. way with the GoPro. But Perfect today. Okay, so here's the deal. The girls are a little bit tired after all the adventures I've been taking them on. <laughs> So only me and Justin are going to be diving, but I'm going to show you something that I've been keeping or holding back for a few days. I have a montage from this spectacular world-class diving site. This is not a sanctuary. This is just a port that goes from Apo to here for supplies. Little do we know, this is one of the best dive sites here in Sabokita. Very close to Darwin. So let's roll it because this is going to be freaking epic. Gear is set up. Let's rock and roll. Are you hot? I'm I'm burning guys. We need to get out of the water. Putting out the equipment and the blazing heat. Let's Ooh. do let's do uh diving briefing. Let's go diving. Let's go diving. 
go that way. That's the briefing. I'm just trying to delay because he's hot. No, that's the road. We go down, we go up, we go home. <laughs> Alright, jump shot. Just there, we do jump shot. Yeah, yeah don't jump okay. here. One, two. <laughs> Wait, one well, more we'll try. One more set. Never mind. Never mind. <laughs> Can I do a jump shot? Yeah, you. <laughs> <laughs> I can't do it. Here we go, one of our favorite dive sites in all of Negros Oriental. We are here in San Poquita at Malatapai. And one of the first critters we spot is the one of our top ones, the flamboyant cuttlefish. We just love these guys, how they walk, stretch their body and how they feed, changing colors, morphing, blending in with the environment. We love these guys. And even here is walking backwards. I haven't seen that before. And one of our bucket shots, him feeding. One of our favorite things diving here in Darwin is that almost at every single dive we find a new species so it keeps on being excited each and every dive. For example, this Melipe Nuribrank, never seen that one before. This was our second time finding the Polybranchia nudibranch or sea slug and this one is endemic to the Philippines. Philippines has a couple of endemic species above land, but when it comes down to underwater, there is countless of endemic species here in the country, and each year there are new ones found. One of the most surprising things we saw on the dive was this eagle ray swimming near the shoreline. This one we've never seen at the coast of Negros. And here we got one of our bucket list critters. This is the CRC. Not only they're absolutely gorgeous, they look like a flower or even a butterfly, but it's also really hard to find them because they are almost fully transparent. Now I didn't get great shots of this one, but I got some cool pictures.
here we have yet another first one for me. This is a Lopiger nude brand I've never seen before. Such a strange shape. I love his green body. I think I can see a shell as well. And then the orange things on his rhino force or whatever. Just a crazy looking dude. But this one might have been our favorite. This is a CRC we've never seen before. Massive in size, maybe about 10 centimeters long. But above all, look how beautiful this thing is. This creature, almost transparent, gorgeous, cyan, reddish, purple, shining dots on him. And one thing that makes him stand out are the blue dots. This CRC is endemic to the Philippines as well. Only found here. How's your diving, babe? And that's how good Malatapa is. Actually, on this dive, it was probably one of the worst dives so far. <laughs> Didn't what? see much. But the previous clip that I might have shown you here to show you how good this dives I can be. But fortunately, this dive here today was not that great, but in the previous ones, it's been mind blowing. 2021 socializing. <laughs> Looking at photos. <laughs> Would you guys wanna go back in time and all of these units gone? <laughs> then, we okay. have to, then we have to read the newspaper. Yeah, so don't be shocked if there's gonna be a brown nut. Oh my, really? Yeah. When it's raining hard? Yeah. Always when it's raining hard here, they are oh my, brown I'm nut. scared of the dark. <laughs> <laughs> I can't. Yes, it goes in the It's crazy right now. <laughs> Hello. Anime. <laughs> <laughs> you guys ready? I'm ready. What about Shalen? <laughs> Two hours later. Almost like a pilot on the F 50 is about to drop bomb. Headed to Hyundai, picking up Blue Thunder, and they're gonna show us the old parts. I'm very curious to see that actually. Look at the <laughs> It's a lot of bumpers. That's what you call a, a bump, bunker, bumper graveyard or cemetery. <laughs> That's one of ours. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, look how broken that is. This one will be make a noise. Oh, that whole unit. Yes, this, including this one, right? Yeah. There's a metal part here. Yeah. Where's the uh, bend? Where did it yeah. bend? This part. Yeah. Oh, yeah, wow. Look at that. This is supposed to be a yeah, nice curve here, but you're okay. mm -hmm. gonna see how it's sticking out. So you can tell, like, this whole unit has, like, real curved. That's not good. Last time this was all hanging down and total mess. 
All right, Hyundai's done. Now we're in Robinson's. Gonna find the girls, do some shopping, and then I'm gonna explain a little bit about the car insurance that I have here and the importance of that a little bit later. This is awesome. Wait, wait for it. So right now all restaurants are takeout I think. There's no dining anymore for the next two weeks. I miss the old Philippines, slippers only. Now everything is getting more strict. By the way, right now this city, Dumaguete, is uh, the highest spreading COVID in the uh, Philippines for every 100,000 people. So we went from Cebu City, which was like the number one, back to another one that's number one. What's going on? I want to share some update about this lockdown that's happening here. As you guys have mentioned, I just I try to ignore all of these things now. But I can't help to reveal that all of our plans went out of the window once again. We were supposed to go to Mindanao. I think I mentioned it before. We had a pretty cool trip planned up. But CDO, Negros Oriental, everything is in lockdown. That's all I gotta say about that for now because... Do you hear that cow? There's a cow here, man. Where's the cow? There was a regular traffic jam, a Dowan traffic jam on your road, dude. Why? Like two, two goats and a cow. I couldn't even get through, man. This goat. <laughs> Wait, are you telling me there was a livestock traffic at the road? Freaking Dowan traffic jam. <laughs> That's I'm driving hilarious. like one mile an hour because this goat wouldn't leave. <laughs> That's funny. Well, we're dropping off Anna. This is her last day. She's going back home to CDO. Bye bye, take care, safe trip. Bye.